Hi, how are you? Matt Watson here from CarWow. So I'm sat in the new BMW M240i Coupe. Next to me is an Audi RS3 Saloon, and next to that is a Mercedes CLA. And we are going to have a drag race because I want to know if this BMW M Lite can beat the full fat RS and AMG versions of the equivalent size vehicles. Now, if you like these kind of drag races, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you won't miss a single upload. So do that if you haven't done so already because you're missing out on loads of stuff. Also, helps me get cool cars for you to watch. Anyway, let me run through the stats because I know you love them. This BMW has a three litre straight six turbocharged engine with 374 horsepower and 500 newton meters of torque, drives all four wheels for an eight speed automatic gearbox with a torque converter, but it does have launch control. Now this car weighs in at 1,690 kilos. So it's pretty heavy. In terms of the price, 46,000 pounds starting. That Audi, it starts from 56,000 pounds. However, you've got a 2.5 5 litre inline five cylinder with a turbocharger that puts out 400 horsepower and 500 newton meters of torque. It has a seven speed dual clutch automatic gearbox with launch control driving all four wheels. It weighs in at 1,575 kilos, so over 100 kilos lighter than this BMW. Finally, we come to the Mercedes. It has a two litre turbocharged engine, which is the smallest engine here, but it's most powerful because AMG. So it puts out 421 horsepower and 500 newton meters of torque. It drives all four wheels for an eight speed dual clutch automatic gearbox with launch control. In terms of the weight, that car is the heaviest. It weighs 1,695 kilos. It's also the most expensive. Starts from 61,000 pounds. Anyway, shall we get on with the race? Oh, before we do, if you're thinking about changing your car, head to CarWow. So not only can you buy cars through us and check the prices right with various offers, you can also sell your current car through us as well and our dealers will bid on your car. If you want to find out more about that now, click on the pop-out banner up there or follow the link in the description below. Alternatively, at a later date, simply Google Wow Me Car Wow and we will wow you. Will this BMW wow you as well? We're going to find out. Hmm, I reckon it could surprise and cause a bit of an upset. Anyway, let's do it. Buy, sell, car, wow. Now, before we start the race, got to do the obligatory car wow sound check. So I've got the most cylinders. I must be able to make the most noise. So I'm going to find out. Sports mode, yes. Let's rev it up. Rev, rev, rev. <laughs> Gotta love a BMW. No soft limiter. I think the noise in here is slightly artificial to the speakers. Anyway, you'll be the judge of the outside noise. Let's have a listen to this RS3. Let's hear your ass rev. I'm trying my very best. 4,000 soft limit. You've always got a softy, you. Okay, let's hear the AMG. Surely that's loud. I could hear that more than I could hear the Audi, and the Audi's closer to me. I think that's a win for the Mercedes, don't you? Before we go, we're gonna warm up our tires because we can. So this may have a four wheel drive system, but it's rear drive biased apparently. It doesn't have the trick systems of those cars, but let's see if I can do some form of slide didge. Let's go the other way. Uh, 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 uh. Go in the grass, mate. You don't want to go in the grass. That would style it out, style it out, style it out. Right, that's enough. Sort of styled that out. Let's see what they can do with their superior drift modes. Oh, that's enough, that's enough. That's um, not our car. That has been lent to us by a car wow viewer. So if you want us to review your car and not drive it like that, <laughs> just email us at reviewmycarwow.co.uk. By the way, quick shout out to the guy who lent us that. If you want to check out his Instagram, it's appearing on the screen now. Moving on, let's see what the Mercedes MG can do. Go on, drift that. Oh yeah, see, that's good. I think that system worked better than the one in the Audi. Don't you concur, Audi? Yeah, I'm not a fan of this torque vectoring, fake drift stuff. It's not my favorite. A bad workman blames his tools. Let's race. Three, two, one. Smash them off the line. Can that Audi pull me back? What is that Mercedes doing? Has he got a problem with this engine? Come on, BMW! Come on!
first question, Audi. Do you think I jumped the start? I always think you jumped the start, but no, I actually don't think you did. I had a terrible start. The uh, delay when you come off the brake in this, I didn't time it very well. I think this would have been a lot closer, and I think this will beat you if you allow me another go. I don't think I want to. I suppose I better. Three, two, one. He cheated for sure. I'm going to do that Mercedes. Okay, Audi, um, you tried to time your launch. I've got a feeling you were a bit premature, or maybe that time I was a bit delayed. Yeah, it could have been slightly early, but I don't think it was. Regardless, AMG, I beat you. Then I'm pretty sure I got off the line at the exact same time as the Audi, but there you go. Okay, let's go to the steward's inquiry. Was there a jump? Uh, we are trying that to me sounded like a definite yes. Let's go again. Best two out of three, I think, regardless of what the steward might have said. No idea. Don't care. Three, two, one. It's close off the line. That Mercedes has been dropped. Come on, BMW. It's not far behind. <laughs> Woo! I've never been so happy with second place. <laughs> okay, Audi, you won. But we left the line pretty much close together. So I've got to go to you, Mercedes. What happened? Were you neck and neck off the line and just couldn't keep up? Click off the line in, in that one. But I feel like I'm having to come off the brake before Nick even signals to start the race. So the delay in this is pretty awful. But once you are off the line, the acceleration seems pretty off as well. I mean, odd. So then what exactly happened? Well, the Audi won, completing the standing quarter mile in 11.9 seconds. The BMW was second, finishing in 12.2 seconds, and the Mercedes was last, crossing the line in 12.7 seconds. Now we can have a rolling race from 50 miles an hour. The cars are in comfort mode, automatic mode for the gearbox. I'm gonna count it in, let's see what happens. Who's first to the half mile? Three, two, one, go. Kick down, pretty quick. That Mercedes is off this time. Can it win this race to the half mile? That Audi's starting to creep past me now. Where's the half mile? There we go, Mercedes AMG. That kick down was epic. Mine wasn't too bad. The Audi, I think, probably the slowest, but then you came past me, right? My Audi is still currently kicking down, but yeah, I did come past you. Let's take the gearbox kick down out of the equation. Okay, same again. This time though, we're in the sporty setting, locked in third gear. So here we go. Three, two, one, go. This picked up so well. God, now my gear changes because it won't auto shift up in manual. I'm in it for this. Come on, hold on to the rims. Come on. Absolutely no idea who won that. Maybe me? Is that right, Andy? You can car? I think you may have just had it, or the Merc. I definitely came last. It's between you and the Merc, I think. Let's photo finish, and that will reveal all. It was me! Okay, now we're gonna have a brake test from 100 miles an hour. See which car stops in the shortest distance. If you'd rather watch some more drag races though, put a link to a really cool drag race up there. Just follow that link or follow the link in the description, okay? If not, stay here. Let's see which car stops in the shortest distance from 100 miles an hour. When we reach live, full emergency stop. Come on, BMW, you got this. This one has the upgraded brakes. Will they work? They worked. They're part of the Performance Pro Pack, FYI. I won that. Did I break too early? Well, I thought I broke a little bit early. Now, all I need is for the Mercedes to go, I broke early as well, and then we could just call it a day because they all cheated and it is what it is. Yeah, uh, maybe broke a little bit early. I think they want to go home and wrap this up. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that was a lot of fun. Now, I found a cool discount 
on one of these cars through Carway. It's really quite a, an impressive discount. To find out what the car is and the discount, click on the pop-out banner up there. I'll follow the link in the description below. Also, if you're not doing so already, follow me on Instagram. Matt Watson Cars. Lots of behind the scenes stuff and extra stuff you don't see here. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. Let me know which is your favourite car in the comments below. Click on those windows there to watch some more videos. And if you click on that box there, you can go to CarWow to change your car. Make sure you're paying the fair price for the car you want to buy. And our dealers will bid on your car to make sure you get a great price for it. Thanks for watching.